Okay, I'm out here shooting the moon tonight. Thought I saw something, an extra shadow on one side of the moon. Apparently, apparently it's not there. But we'll go out here and uh, see if we can. The moon is moving. It's actually moving. Now that's me adjusting the camera. But when I get it real close, you'll be able to see the moon moving. See how it's moving towards the right? Maybe so slightly. That's not me, that's not the camera. This is a really good tripod I, I got from my, this camera, this P1000. The moon is moving on its own, okay. I've told you before that the Earth is stable on four foundations. It never moves, ever. It's a flat Earth. It's founded on four foundations. The Earth is immovable, as it says in scriptures. Maybe 250 places. Okay. There, see, look at that. That's moving on its own. Uh, I'm going to get in as far as I can. You see it shaking now? That's because my hand is on the camera. I still don't have the remote yet, and Nikon doesn't know when they're going to get it. So, there it is. That's the moon moving on its own. Moving to my right. And the light you see, those light spots, it's slice being emitted from the moon itself, it's coming out from the moon, it's not coming from the sun. The sun has directional, directed light when it uh, shoots its rays. It doesn't go to the other side of the earth. There is no other side of the earth. And that light that you see, see part of the moon is not visible? That's because the light is directed. It's directed directly from the moon itself. And that's how you get the different phases of the moon. And it's moving right out of my range. I'm going to back up a little bit. Now it's going to seem to move slower. That's because we're further out. But I can still see it moving to the right. Really have pretty good as I can see up to five thousandths or less of an inch. I've been doing that for a while. Okay. I remember one job I had in Boston and I told them I could see less than five thousandths of an inch and I had to prove that I was only a kid about 16 and they said you can nobody can see five thousandths of an inch and I did. I was an artwork inspector an electronics company called Teradon in Boston. Anyway, <laughs> just to verify a little bit of that. They couldn't believe that I could see less than five thousandths of an inch. Okay. You see it? You can see this is moving. It's moving to my right. We'll go a little further out. Oh, it's, it's all the way out there. Okay, that's all I wanted to show tonight. Have a good day.